This test will determine whether or not the number 8 wire that I currently have running between the pow primary power system, the PPS, starter output, and the starter uh, would be able to sustain the uh, full starting load, current load, uh, during an 8 second run of the starter. The, battery is, uh, the batteries are freshly charged, 14.02 volts. We're going to be noting the uh, success of the starting sequence. We're going to be noting the uh, temperature, apparent temperature of the, of the number 8 wire, as well as the uh, voltage as measured at the starter during the course of the start. <clears throat> so this will be for about 8 seconds. The start beginning in 3, 2, one. Okay, for a full eight seconds, the wire gets quite warm. Hot, I would call it hot. The, uh, the number six wire that runs from the starter motor to this to the uh, starter solenoid is is okay it's a little warm but that's about it uh, the uh, connection at the primary power system is fine uh, again the uh, number eight wire does get fairly warm now this is THHN building wire and uh, the wire that I would ultimately use and have ordered is uh, a uh, mil spec wire uh, with Teflon insulation and a temperature rating of 200 degrees Celsius. So uh, clearly the number eight wire will work for an emergency start situation when the uh, uh, contactor that will be installed in a paralleled number two wire coming from the primary power system to the starter, uh, if that starter were to, f if that solenoid were to, or correction contactor were to fail in the open position, the, uh, the start sequence could still be completed. Now bear in mind that in reality uh, you would never really see eight seconds of full load uh, in, a start, in a normal start sequence. By the time four seconds has gone by the uh, ignition has taken place and the engine is accelerating under, uh, combustion, under the influence of combustion and therefore the uh, current drawn by the starter would uh, diminish d uh, dramatically. So I uh, consider this to be a successful start. I will now review the video to determine how low the voltage got during the, uh, at the starter during the start. But uh, generally I would say this is a, su a successful test.